So hi, this is Steve Spence, and I'm the owner of ArduinoTronics.blogspot.com, where we discuss various ways to use the Arduino microprocessor to control our home environment. And I've done a test tonight that I just wanted to show you. Um, I have the Arduino here. That's the little black microcomputer. And it's connected to my Linux laptop through a USB cable. And I've got it wired up to a breadboard. And I've got a small program running that will just alternatively uh, fade the red, white, and blue LEDs. And the Arduino is much more powerful than just for fading LEDs, but I just wanted to do a simple sample of what can be done with it. And basically, I've got three digital pins on the Arduino, and those three pins are connected to the anodes on the three LEDs. And then the cathodes, that's the positive, the cathodes, the negative, connect to a 270 ohm resistor and then back to the ground on the Arduino. So that's the electrical connections. Now, the code, you can see it here, I'm defining three pins, pins 9, 10, and 11, and all the code does is ramp up the signal on pins 9, then 10, then 11, ramps up the signal and then brings it back down again so that it fades each LED in sequence. So we've defined the pins, we've said what pins we're going to output the signal on, we've connected the LEDs to each one of those pins, and then I'm just writing out the values of those pins. And there's just three for loops, one for each LED. And it's a very simple program. It doesn't really do a whole lot except show the capabilities and how a digital pin is enabled and a signal is taken out. If you go to my website, arduinotronics.blogspot.com, you'll learn a lot about the Arduino microprocessor, um, what its capabilities are, and how to program it, how to wire it and I'll be posting more videos and more projects on this site. So check it out. That's arduinotronics.blogspot.com and enjoy what you learn. Thank you very much.